Welcome to another video in which we are going to write Python program to check if two strings are anagram. So guys basically two strings are said to be anagram if we can form one string by arranging the characters of another string. So for example as you can see over here raise and care are the anagrams as one word can be formed by rearranging the other word over here so guys how we can check if the two strings that is entered by the user are anagrams or not so the simple logic over here is we can have both the strings converted to the lowercase characters and then we can sort them so that they are sorted alphabetically which can be then compared in order to see whether those alphabets are exactly matching or not with each other so guys let us check this with the help of example now in the vs code over here so let's say we have string 1 it is equal to race in this case and string 2 that is str2 it is equal to care this time so we are going to take the same example that is race and care so the very first thing that we will be doing is converting it into the lowercase letters so that the comparison of two strings ignores the cases so over here str1 it is equal to str1 over here followed by dot and then we have something called as lower function so guys basically this returns a copy of the string converted to lowercase so we are going to use this function over here same thing we are going to do with str2 it is equal to str2 followed by dot and then lower so we can quickly verify the returned string over here so we will print str1 and then str2 as well over here let me just save this file now and try running this code so as you can see we are getting race and care which are lowercase characters this time which can be compared easily which will be case insensitive comparison now guys what we have to do is we need to check whether the length of both the strings is same or not so we say that the two strings are anagram only when the length of both the strings are same over here so we say if and then followed by length of string 1 in this case so length of string 1 is it equal to len of str2 as well so we need to check this and then if it is true then we are going to write our logic but if it is not true then we have to come in the else part and then we have to say that these two strings are not anagram so we will print str1 over here so str1 and str2 this time are not anagrams so guys over here we have provided f and then we can access any of the variables while providing the open and close curly braces over here as you can see now guys what if the length of both the strings are same like in this case in our example the length of both the strings is 4 this time so the control flow will go inside this if condition and then what we have to do is we need to sort these strings so basically we have the sorted function that will help us in order to get the sorted character arrays of both the strings that is string 1 and string 2 so guys what we will do is we have to provide the parameter that is str1 and then we can simply store it in sorted str1 over here so basically this sorted str1 it is the character array and it is not a string and then similarly we will have sorted string 2 this time so we say sorted str2 and then over here we say sorted str2 now guys in order to confirm this we can have the print statement once again and then we will say sorted str1 this time and then another print statement that will say sorted str2 so let me just save this file now and try running this code so as you can see it has sorted all the characters one at a time and it is storing it in a character array over here so first we have a and then we have c and then we have e and then we have r so guys basically we have sorted both the strings and we are storing it in the character array now we can compare both these character array by using equal to equal to operator so again we need to use the if condition and then we say sorted str1 is equal to sorted str2 this time which means that all the characters are at same position over here and if they are equal then both the strings are anagram so over here what we will do is i'll simply copy this line of code that is a print statement and paste this over here and we will say str1 and str2 are anagrams over here and i'll just remove this not keyword 
but if both the sorted versions that is sorted str1 and sorted str2 are not equal then we have to come in the else part over here so we have the else block and we print the same statement that is str1 and str2 are not anagrams this time so basically guys if they are not equal after getting sorted which means one or the other character is not matching at a particular position then they are not anagrams over here so let me just save this file now and try running this code so as you can see raise and care are anagrams over here that's because we can rearrange the characters of one word into a sequence in such a way that it will be equal to another word over here now guys let us say we have five characters over here in both these words so let's say we have racer over here instead of race and then we say cares over here instead of care in this case so guys basically up to four characters both of them were anagrams but what if when we provide these characters over here at the end so basically since both these characters are not same so in this case we should get not anagrams over here being printed on the terminal so let me just run this code once again so as you can see racer and cares are not anagrams over here if we print the sorted versions of the strings that we have provided we can print them by using the print function so we say print sorted str1 and then we have sorted str2 before printing whether they are anagrams or not let me just run this code once again as you can see we have got the first four characters same that is a c e r but the fifth character that is r is not matching with the fifth character of the second word that is s and that is why they are not anagrams over here so guys this is the very simple code in order to check whether the two entered strings by the user are the anagrams or not by first checking the length of both the strings and if they are equal then we need to check the sorted versions of both the strings and if they are equal then they are anagrams or else they are not anagrams over here guys please make sure that you practice on your own so that on different inputs you get different outputs make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to the channel so that you get the notifications on upcoming videos as well the next video that we are going to talk about is python program to capitalize the first character of a string so stay tuned